Hey everyone, Dave here and welcome to Grid Legends Overview. This should be like a roller coaster of the release considering what info we have so far. If you've been a while in the gaming industry, you damn well know who EA is and what game they produce. The issue is that we don't have much in return, like there's not much info, the trailer looks garbage, <laughs> Meta just silently threw it into the store thinking that people won't even notice, there's just so many weird things going around it. Regardless of that, we're gonna set the higher standard because for a company like that, you have the budget and you have the developers, so there's no excuse at this point. Let's see how this turns out. <laughs> so Grid Legends is a true racing simulator where you'll be able to partake in the legendary tracks using legendary vehicles for legendary results with action-packed gameplay in the career mode and race against other drivers in multiplayer. Personally, I'm not huge into this type of gameplay. I much prefer the arcadey ones like Dash Dash or just anything that removes the simulator aspect of it because sometimes it can be just too hard to control and my enjoyment instantly drops when there's just a struggle involved. I'm not quite sure how it's gonna work on Quest 2 since knowing the limits of that platform and just looking at the trailer, this kinda looks like a hot mess just purely in terms of the graphics. They tried to hide it and enhance the footage but in between the frames I can literally see the blurry ass textures. We say it's not all about the graphics but that's pretty much the reason why we've never had a proper racing like realistic game because it's not gonna be realistic looking. The idea is great because the install size is quite big, <laughs> so I'm sure there's lots of content and just things to do. It's all a big mystery how it's gonna be performance wise and if EA actually puts some effort in it and not being lazy about it. It is kind of a full circle for me because I clearly remember my first ever PC game in my life was Need for Speed Underground and I remember I had no idea what I'm doing but I was just having fun and that's all that mattered and I hope this one will like push through and not be like a joke of the platform. Let's go into the gameplay. And that's Raven West, Nathan McCain and Laura Carvalho mm, in the charge here okay. at Strada Flat screen. With Seneca's you made Tanaka hot on their heels and has been for the last eight laps. Could this be the race where she makes Grid World Series history? Is it like an introduction of the story? One man army in the midfield, trying to gain ground but being blocked by North Point. I can't get through. Tell them to defend. I woke up in a great mood that day. The weather was perfect. The team was finally getting noticed. Number 22 defends their position. Knights 122, keep pushing. Seneca has been on a magic carpet ride this I don't care, <laughs> like honestly. Oh, oh, oh. <coughs> Wait, what? What is going on? Okay, breathe in, breathe out. <laughs> Oof. Okay, 22, there's too much to bring on track. We need you to come in. That's a negative. Do not retire the car. I repeat, do not retire. Pado, I'm seeing significant damage to 22. And no response from you, May. Is she okay? The medics are on the scene. That's all I know. Just focus on the race. Keep me updated. Can you confirm race strategy? Look, half the field can't finish. If we do, we're in the points. We can't quit. Understood. 22. Finish the race. Go, go! Okay. First of all, this is the worst graphics I've ever seen in the quest history of I'm doing this on the channel. Just putting it out there, like, even quest one was not that bad. Get over the line. Oh wow. <laughs> I thought I would be actually steering with my hands, or maybe just a different control scheme, but I love this. Like, that's what I want to have. Okay, a break. I mean, so far I love the driving, like the gameplay is here for me. That's what I meant about like dash dash mechanics. I just much rather steer with my joystick and just look at the surroundings, which are shit, but... <laughs> it doesn't even help. 
the fact that I'm on the quest pro <laughs> Like I feel like I'm wasting the hardware on it. What about with this cockpit? Okay. Oof. My god. <laughs> um Yeah. We're going for I don't know, like it seemed fine to me, like oh correct. I just don't like this flat screen thing with nothing besides that. And that's Raven West, Nathan McCain and Laura Carvalho leading It's the like they introduce the story but It's all or nothing. Contact. In a situation like this all you can do is hope that the drivers are all okay. It's on? Yeah. Okay. No, I don't care. Like you need to know First, the discipline and players and stuff. Wait, why this looks better? I mean, on the screen, but... Okay, <laughs> you know. Okay, they're taking to place in front of Vega. He's been having some good races recently. Move! Wait, I've been on the street in London. <laughs> so this is actually the good representation. I just don't understand where. 30 gigabytes of memory went. Like, literally. Where? <laughs> Is it the mechanics? Is it the physics? Or maybe it's just that much content. I have no idea why. The visuals are that bad, like it should not be like that. I think it's just due to the depth experience as a first entry, I suppose. Okay, you're looking good. Let's stay in front of Vega. I'm not like a pro at driving, but I seem to be doing fine. Oh, what the? Stop blocking the way. It feels simple. Though, I guess I'm very used to racing while drifting and stuff, so... This is more like an actual simulator. Hey, what are you doing? I just wonder if there's like another set of controls, device types, controllers, unless you can uh, connect your like, I don't know, steering wheel or something, but we're on the quest, so I'm not sure if that makes sense. <laughs> Losers. All right, one lap left. Keep your position ahead of Vega. I don't know who that is. I like the indicator if I'm driving too fast or not to just... ...go comfortably into the turn. Besides the being of in the car, there's not much going on VR-wise.
I should see what's going on in the reflection. Alright. Okay, that's a lot. We have a garage. Customized vehicles. So we have... Oh my lord. Yeah, that seems um, a lot. <laughs> Should we see if someone's playing the multiplayer? Just real quick. Uh, am I online? I mean, the headset didn't ask me for voice permission, so I'm assuming there's no voice chat. Those names are not real. I think the actual person might be here <laughs> in front of me. It's like sometimes you can recognize players by their movement. <laughs> the game seems simple, honestly, like... Yeah, I think that's the actual person. Like, I'm not struggling. It's not hard. Maybe I'm just gifted in the racing simulators. Move out of the way. Oh, you! <laughs> I know how to drift, mate. The last lap time was A to twenty three point four. It's like the pixels are really attacking me. I'm not kidding by saying this is the worst looking game ever. There were some good contenders, but this takes the cake for me. Like I can't see the distance. No, 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 You wish. I need to block him with my ass. That was my mistake. I 
I won't recover from it. Last lap, let's push to the top spot. Oh, okay. Maybe actually following this line is a better idea. I know this is like, you know, recommended path. But I mean, I would prefer to turn this off. I don't know why I'm braking before going to the drift. I think it's just my experience from the arcade racing. Or maybe that's how it used to work back in the day. Where is he? Overall, if I'm judging the gameplay, the dynamic and just the comfortability, I do like this. I absolutely hate the visuals and the graphics, like it can't get worse than that. <laughs> I wish the UI could be a little bit better in terms of immersion, I mean it does its job, but there could be some improvement. It's good, like it's a solid first entry to the simulating like racing game. I'm setting the bar higher because of the studio and just the capabilities and I hope we'll get some, I don't know, graphical improvements or just anything of that sort because the core gameplay seems to be there. I just expect more in general.